Welcome back everyone, this is Icy Mizu bringing you more of Ledger's Hell Sparrow Tracks. So here we are on the top of the Tower of Spirits. If you remember last time we ended up getting that one, this stamped station here. So now we can actually head back up here and get the, comp uh, the compass of light. Huh, they even gives us everything just in case we actually need to be prepared. And the sword beam is just awesome. Got some arrows. Don't need those hearts, but at least I got some arrows. And let's see if I can actually get some more, actually. Because I want more arrows. I want more. More arrows. I need more. More. Wait for the respawn. Only bombs. I already have enough bombs. I need more arrows. That's what I need. Because you tend to use a lot more arrows in this game. Hmm. Well, anyways. Who knew there was somewhere like this under the altar? Right, Link. Time to end this. Together, we can take on anything, right? You bet. And we get a phantom. But we cannot hit him, though. Remember what Angie told us, Link. You new source filled with energy. That means you don't need to grab tears of light to attack the phantoms. Well, I already kind of knew that already, Zelda. But thanks for pointing it out anyways. So, um, let's see here. Just more arrows, anything? Okay. Let's head downstairs and go back to floor 29. This has to be floor 29. It's pitch black in here. We've been in a room like this before, haven't we? Let's do what we did last time. Okay. Uh, apparently, we, we probably have not seen. There's some phantoms as well walking on the way. There's some ones here. I'm trying to get used to this floor, actually. And apparently, Elgot. We're going to be grabbing a uh, phantom right here first. Because we can't do pretty much here. Get in there, Zelda. And we can head back uh, up upstairs again. So here, back on floor 30. And actually, I'm never actually... Kinda don't like to look forward to this last visit on this Tower Spirits, cause you, it's always, you're gonna be going back and forth in this, um... Uh, in this, uh, this particular dungeon, I guess you can say. I don't know. But anyways, we're gonna ride on Zelda and actually go through the other door. Oh wait, but first, keys must die. Sword Beam is awesome. And apparently this switch is timed. Ugh. And there's a phantom over there. Let's wait for him. There we go. We have to switch again, because like I said, it's time. You probably have not noticed by now. Uh, let's see here. How can we get this out of the way? Let's fall down here, and let's see. Go away, key. Okay, so there is another switch, so we have to hit these two switches at the same time. Let's walk away, and ah, god dang it, fire key! Why did you, why did you do that? Uh, you must die. No, you must, ah, uh, fine. Be that way. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna die later. I don't care. Got some phantom here walking around, just, you know, just strolling, you know. Now, we'll go through here. Let's see, yes, I can actually reach. Awesome. Let's sell, let's take Zelda out of the way. Move Zelda out of the way, I mean. Huh. Ah, ah, good, dang it. Ah, okay, that was my fault right there, actually. Uh, let's see here. Oh, whoops. Trying to get a little bit closer. There we go. Right on Zelda. Hit the switch. And hit the switch, uh, boomerang. There we go. And now we can actually head up, uh, upstairs. Downstairs again. Yeah, this actually takes you to a different area. Apparently on the floor. This, uh, the 29th floor. Jeez, man, how many floors this tower has? Like, seriously. Now here... Got some fire, and we got a tablet here. We got some... T and you probably got noticed by now what it says on that tablet. We gotta blow out all the torches. Um, there's one more. That's not it. Is this it? Oh, ha-ha! And does that opens up this door, which also will take us to a flame up. 
Okay, there's a pit there. Yeah, this this place can be quite difficult, but it's not that it's not that bad. Just because of the fact you can't see anywhere where you're going. Oh, uh, oh, uh, whoa. Uh, excuse me. I'm trying to walk away here. Anyways, let's keep going and get this phantom here. And finally, I can actually get a f flame phantom. Seriously, flame storm is awesome. Go now. Let's just move on. We're gonna hit this so we can actually light our uh, light the way. Let's just keep going. Just keep going. Just keep going. 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 Ah, uh, so that you gotta hit the play. This. Yeah. There we go. And that place is. Yeah. This place is. Ah. It's locked. Oh, uh, we look at what we have here. It's a warp phantom. Okay. Uh, let's see here. Okay, let's try to use up. Let me. Okay, so I'll go hit it for me. Go. And then there's another one here. But... Okay, cool. Let's just keep going here. Let's hit this switch here. Oh. Mm. There we go. And let's see here. There's one more torch. There we have it. Okay, let's run away. Let's run away. Up. Oh, here we go. Up. Oh, hot drink it. There we have it. Oh, aha! There's another eye that we have to actually hit at. And this probably this tablet will tell us. Look for the two eyes in shadows. Yeah, that's what it was. And there's this dark phantom who's gonna try to follow me, run away! Go away, phantom, go away. Anything here? No? Okay. Uh, let's just keep going then. Hmm, nothing? Anything? There's a wall there. Okay, let's just go back then. Uh, alright, I keep forgetting. This place, you can actually get lost in here. Don't get me wrong. You could. Just keep going here. We're gonna wait for Zelda so she can actually light us the light away. Actually, I'm gonna turn on these torches too. While I'm at it, it'll make things a lot easier. Um, there's here. There's two over here. Zelda, kill that thing. Yeah, go away. Two. There's another one here. Uh, you should get him for me, since you have the flaming sword. Okay. Three. Eh. Where's the other ones? Anyways, I already light them all up. Now we're gonna head back to floor 30 again. Right on Zelda. And go all the way back where we were. On the other side. Yeah, like I said, um, like I said, this one is one of the only few dun I guess you could say dungeons that I'm not look always look forward to do. It's always a backtracking. I mean I don't mind backtracking, but not this is just too much. Uh, anything? We're gonna grab some hearts. And we're gonna head back here. It's not that we have a flamey, uh, flame, uh, phantom. She can actually, uh, Zelda can light the way. Huh, there's a tablet here. Anything else here? No? But there's a flamey torch over there. Let's try to dodge away from these phantoms. Okay, there we go. Get the other one sold up for me. That opens up the door. Now, let's see what else. I'm actually going to hit this torch right here. Well, not torch. I mean, I'm going to make I'm going to make Zelda to light this place cuz you want to keep this clue in mind. Only those without the special power knows the secret. You just keep that in mind and I'll show you later. 
For now, let's just actually head downstairs, because I'm just looking what's up here or anything. Although I can clearly not see. Uh, excuse me, Zelda. Uh, it's down there. To floor 28. Uh, let's see here. Got a Sam one. Oh, we got some stealth soldiers here. Just one shot it with the ball of light, and just like that. So yeah, the uh, this is the only as guess Nick pick. It isn't that much of a big deal. Is that unlike the ball of lights of how overpower of an item is, uh, overpower of a weapon is on on the previous Zelda games, in here they're not like an instant uh, one shot. The only thing I always uh, I always like about this one is that it doesn't use magic. It doesn't require any magic meter of that kind of sort. But yeah, right here I'm just trying to look for any treasure, any rupees that might be hidden in here. Who knows? Let's stay down here. We're gonna get the stealthles out of the way. By the looks of it, though, I need to bring Zelda this way. Oh my god. I have to bring Zelda? But wait a minute, doesn't she sink? Well, I don't really get it either. I really don't get it. She's supposed to sink under sand, but when there is this pile of sand all the way up here, up like this, she doesn't sink. I seriously don't get it. Whatever, we're gonna get the boomerang here. Hit this. Oh, sorry, Zelda. There we go. We're gonna hit these. We're gonna turn... Well, we're gonna... Turn up the other torch, reveal these two chests. And probably one of these chests should have a key. I believe so. Uh, we're gonna make a path for Zelda to walk through. And I hope I don't need to ride on Zelda either. Ah, excuse me, Zelda. Please don't tell me I actually need to. Ah, uh, I really do. God dang it. Okay. We're gonna get these two chests out of the way at least. Let's keep going here. We're gonna actually run on sale like once again. Um, okay. I guess you didn't want to walk down there instead of taking. You just decided to take the stairs. Okay. I'm gonna walk through here. Grab our sand one, make a path for her to walk on. It's kind of a nifty uh, idea here, though. Uh, I'm gonna get off, and in here, what we have? We get an ancient coin. That's cool. I'm always looking forward for always for treasure. Uh, I'm gonna make a path, and I hope it doesn't get destroyed. Oh god! Is it something I'm not looking forward to? Let's just keep going. And yeah, I can actually get off from here. And in here we get a key. Awesome. Now let's just head back. And there is something I want to get out of the way right now, actually. And I would like to mention as well. Now going back to... Floor 29, and if you actually cross the lava once again, and if you go back to where was that war, that war fence, you probably might cross through this, uh, this other floor. Now, you probably know that, you probably might know, I only have one key, and there are three doors that are locked. Well, I, since, like I said earlier, I wanted to get this out of the way, I'm gonna go to the right one. <laughs> yeah, I'm just giving you clues already ahead, actually, from, from here on. Technically, what you need to do here uh, to do in this temple, you need to actually get these three keys by now when you actually go to this floor. There's some some eyeballs here we actually poke, but we cannot go through it because we're just limited to one few places. So there's a phantom eye here, but we can't really do much about it. But there is a tablet here. We actually want to take note of this tablet. We're gonna blow out that place. Put the bomb out of the way. I'm not expecting the phantom to move at all, actually. Nope, the phantom's not moving. Okay. Get the boomerang. Blow it up. Get my arrows. Get the phantom out of the way. Just like that. Boom, headshot. Now, light in this order. 
the undefended flame, the flame surrounded by sand. Now here's the thing, I'll click to show you in the map. There's these four torches that if you took the, um, the middle path, it would take you to this particular room. So, there are four torches in, in, in different orders. They're placed in different order. So, here's gonna be three, here's gonna be four. The one that says one is surrounded by the abyss, and the other one surrounded by, uh, that is guarded. <laughs> now, let's just walk up here and let's see what's up here, actually. I wanna know what's in here. I really, really do. Just to get things out of the way. At least Zelda here can actually close it. Too bad we don't have the Wrecker, <laughs> Wrecker Phantom, because the Wrecker Phantom is the much more fun, uh, the fun one in, in this game. Um, let's keep going, Zelda, and I hope this switch actually stops those. Yep, it stops those boulders. Huh? We got a teleporter here. Hmm. Pretty much, we can't do anything here, so let's just head back. If this cell, uh, if actually cell that comes as fast as fast enough, we're gonna go back here. Let's just keep going. Gotta wait for cell as well. Might as well get some arrows, get some hearts. I already got those hearts also. And also along the way, you wanna make sure to get the. I wanna save your actually first, but make sure to get uh the war phantom. Now we're going back to this floor 29, and do you remember that the clue, the clue that I said? Only the ones who doesn't know the secret knows the truth. Well, if you make Zelda talk one of the Phantom, it, the Phantom actually literally tells you the clue and what to do. And by here, oh, and since it does, it, since you don't see it on the screen, I'll say it. They say tell um, it's pretty much says that the. Uh, the wall right on the upper left corner, it's weak, so... Just from that clue, it's... Well, probably, you know, by now, we gotta blow it up! Now, we're gonna go all the way up. Go all the way here. Place a bomb. And yeah, you want... You, this is crucial here. You want a cap of warp phantom, trust me. You're gonna be needing one. Now, we're this floor. Let's just keep going. Going upstairs. More stairs. Come on, Zelda. And we are here in floor 30 yet again. Ooh, look at that. We're gonna blow this thing up, actually. And there's some teleporters here. Huh. Now let's see what's behind all these uh, these rocks. Oh, there's a treasure. Cool. Let's just wait for the bomb to blow up. And let's get this uh, treasure. And what's in here? We get a gold raw member. Okay, that's, that's cool. That's pretty cool. Uh, let's see here. Okay, let me take out the sand one here. I want to check if there's any treasures here too. No groupies, no nothing? Okay. Oh, ha! There's a switch. So, we're gonna have Zelda walk away here. So I'll stay here. I have Zelda. Let's go back here. And let's. Okay, and let's not fall off. Ugh. I'm dang it. Let's try this again. Put on Zelda. Go towards the word switch. Press on the switch. And it makes a phantom up here. And remember, the warp phantoms can, war uh, can well, warp to the phantom eyes. <laughs> Go. Let's keep going, Zelda. Now, I actually want to land on this. Ah, okay. Let's try this again. We want to make sure Zelda actually lands on the tel. Uh, make sure that the Phantom is actually walking towards the to the, te the teleporter here, because well, we need to have Zelda to cross the sand, and she cannot cross sand. There we have it. 
Well, it's not that Zelda can cross the sand, it's just Link cannot go there, to the other side. There we go. And... we're gonna walk towards here. And hide. We're gonna take Zelda to warp on the Phantom Mind, it's here. And actually, I'm gonna end things off here, so alright. So, next time I'll let you sell Spirit Tracks, we're gonna finish things off here on the Tower of Spirits. <coughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. <coughs> so, this is Isaac Mizu saying, see you guys later.